What's going on guys? J Canada back with another connected franchise video in the long awaited decision question mark or quotation mark quotation mark. I messed that up, but yes, we are gonna see where J Canada lands here in the offseason. It's been a tumultuous end to the season. I threw my teammates under the bus, but I sometimes consider pulling a Terrence Terrell Owens. It's my team. It's my quarterback. And if you guys do that, man, it's unfair. We lost as a team. Russell Wilson, my teammate. He's my quarterback. Okay, just kidding. <laughs> I butchered uh, Terrell Owens' name there, but we're doing this one take. So yeah, this is me simulating after the season. You guys helped me out with exactly how you do it, uh, go about becoming a free agent. And everybody that's watched this video has left a comment on which team I should go to. So at some point, I'll post them up here. I haven't finished editing. I'll put them up here on the screen, but everybody has different suggestions. Quite a few people say the Patriots, the Broncos, the Packers, all these elite quarterback teams. Unfortunately, you guys want me to go to elite quarterback this year, like in real life this year. You know, your Peyton Mannings, your Tom Brady's, your Drew Brees's, your Aaron Rodgers. But this is like three years down the road now. And unfortunately, three years down the road, most of those guys are either retired or they're kind of fall they've kind of fallen off. Peyton Manning is retired. Uh, Tom Brady falls down to like an 88 or something. And there's actually not that many elite quarterbacks. So at this point in my career, the best quarterback, you'll never guess it. It's Russell Wilson. So I severely uh, considered actually staying with the Seahawks. But then I realized, you know what? No, everybody wants change. But uh, since nobody could really agree on a team, and I mean, I guess there were a few people saying New England. But uh, yeah, Tom Brady's just not that great in this year. I'm not sure if I added, showed any of the other quarterbacks, but You'll see who I do choose. I don't think anybody suggested it, so I apologize if you don't like my uh, where I'm going to land, but it's hard. To, I couldn't really please everybody when there's like 10, 12, 15 different uh, teams being suggested. And the other thing is, as you're going to see here in a second, after I demanded my release, which is what you got to do in case you didn't know, you got to advance, to, advance uh, to the end of the season and demand uh, release. Then after like the second stage or whatever they're called in the off season, you'll get some contract offers, but you won't get like every team to choose from. So that was one of the problems. A lot of the teams you guys suggested, uh, including the Packers, who I was pretty much going to go to if they offered me a contract, they weren't on there. So that's basically what's going on. Um, I actually found that when I put skill po or experience points into my player to make them better, like up to a 90 overall, uh, I got less contract offers. You'll see in the top right, the overall says 91 right now, but that's not exactly legit. It just goes up for some reason occasionally. But anyways, you see uh, the Colts there at the bottom offering me Texans, Giants, Seahawks. Uh, that was looking at Seahawks, Cardinals, Redskins, Bears, uh, Ravens, Panthers, Dolphins, Falcons, Eagles, uh, Bengals. So a, a lot of the teams you guys offered or you guys wanted me to go to weren't there. The team I actually really wanted to go to was the Cleveland Browns because Johnny Manziel is like the second best quarterback behind Russell Wilson. Or I think it goes Russell Wilson, Colin Kaepernick, and Johnny Manziel in this season. And I know this because I simmed ahead a couple times and went to some different teams, but Cleveland didn't offer me a contract. Uh, my second, uh, well, actually Aaron Rodgers is up there in quarterbacks. Uh, my second option, which was Aaron Rodgers and the Packers, didn't offer me a contract. Didn't want to go back to the Seahawks. Uh, the Chargers don't have Phillip Rivers anymore. I considered Oakland or Jacksonville. They have young quarterbacks, Derek Carr and uh, what's his name, Blake Bortles. But at the end of the day, my decision was we're going to go with a drum roll. Da -da 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 -da. Actually, I don't <laughs> What was that. Pretend I didn't just make that noise, but we're going to see my decision. I'm going back and forth. The Eagles with Nick Foles. Nick Foles is a pretty solid quarterback. I'm going, I'm going, and I'm scrolling down and I'm... Uh, uh, okay, I kind of ruined it. <laughs> I'm sitting on the Colts for a long time. I should have edited this video better, but yes. You'll see I accept a $25.5 million offer from the Indianapolis Colts for five years. Uh, Chuck Pagano, the coach, it says I'm a poor fit uh, scheme-wise, but okay, come on, just click on the <laughs> click on the Colts um, or maybe the Chargers or maybe, okay, I apologize, guys. I, I did a terrible job of, terrible job of, <laughs> building the tension but Jay Canada is an Indianapolis Colt there you have it and I apologize if somebody did comment Colts and I didn't see but I don't think anybody did so I chose the Colts because after I went through a bunch of the quarterbacks uh what their ratings were Andrew Lux is really good you'll see I think he's a 95 overall but I really looked at some of the 
other attributes like throw power and deep throw accuracy and that kind of stuff. Um, unfortunately, Luck's deep throw accuracy isn't that great, but all his other stats are really high. So yeah, other than Russell Wilson, he's one of the best. Uh, one of the best there was, and he was one of the few elite, elite quarterbacks that I could find that was actually offering me a contract. His team, anyway. So that's what we went with the Indianapolis Colts. I hope you guys like that. I don't know how much longer I'm going to play with this wide receiver. Like I want to, we, we got to at least win one playoff game. So maybe after this year, we'll see if we can win a Super Bowl even with the Colts. And then maybe we'll move on to a different connected franchise. I know some people have been saying stuff about a wide receiver or something, maybe ultimate team. I don't know. I got a lot of time now with the exams almost over and Christmas break coming up. I got a lot of time to plan stuff out and and work on some new projects. So anyways, let me know what you guys are thinking. Uh, as you saw there, I put uh, my experience points. I had a ton into catch and traffic and spectacular catch. So I shouldn't make any drops. Well, I mean, I guess I will have some. But yeah, uh, Andrew Luck is a 95. His accuracies are all 90 other than deep throw. But whatever. Uh, we had pretty much no running back. And we had a good second option at wide receiver in Kazim Walker. The offensive line is kind of solid. Kazim Walker too, I think. I don't know if he's a real player because... He, it says he's a rookie, so I don't know if they generically make their rookies in this game. I don't really know how it works, but anyways, I'm not sure why I stepped uh, left on Phil Taylor there, but we got an 81 left end, 89 right end, 81 defensive tackle. I think we play a 3-4 here in Indianapolis because Robert Mathis, 91 right outside linebacker, so he's even 91 playing left. Middle linebacker, we got 81 Jackson, 77 Sharpton, not bad, and Robert Quinn, 92 on the right outside. Cornerback Vontae Davis and Jay Smith. Not sure which Smith that is. So good corners, decent safeties. And the biggest weakness for this team right here, kicker. We don't have a kicker. All we have is Pat McPhee, our punter, and he's an 80 overall kicker. So when it comes down to clutch situation and he misses one, you guys are going to know. You, you already know I'm going to freak out at that. So anyways, here's some highlights from the preseason. Very first play from scrimmage with Andrew Luck, or maybe it was the second. That is what we like to call Russell Wilson. <laughs> a pick six. You guys know what I'm talking about. But uh, we do come back here later in the uh, first quarter. You only get one quarter in preseason and hook up with a nice slant over the middle. I'm just showing a couple highlights from the preseason. Because, of course, you only get the one quarter. So here I got single coverage. And I've been running weird routes like this. Well, actually, that guy, he just left me. <laughs> I didn't even have to do much. But I've been working on just zigging out and zigging back, kind of trying to confuse the defenders. I don't know. I'll try and get it to work in some live commentary so you guys know what I'm talking about but there was a nice 67 8 something yard touchdown throw and catch and I think I, I think I'm gonna enjoy it in Indianapolis as long as luck doesn't throw too many of those pick sixes here's another deep play and I hold on to it I got hit I think I only in like four quarters I only saw one iffy drop by Jay Canada so anyways hope you guys don't mind I just had to throw a screen here at the end so I could talk over something but hope you guys don't mind I chose to go to the Colts let me know what you think let me know what you think of Andrew Luck I realized that that one person who commented and said any quarterback is going to screw me over I believe you but you know I got to keep going with it so anyways thanks for watching guys like the video if you liked it subscribe if you haven't already and comment if you'd like peace